Hi everybody, Jerry with Lonely Pines Farm. Today we're going to talk about the best way for you to get a head start planting for spring without a greenhouse. This is what we call jug sowing. Some people call it winter sowing. All it is is recycling milk jugs to make greenhouses in. Early in spring, it's almost impossible to get anything to germinate outside, right? So unless you're planting in 72 trays and under lights or you have a greenhouse, you can't really get a head start. This makes a fantastic little greenhouse. Last year we planted a bunch of onions, uh, some herbs, uh, some flowers as well, lettuces, spinach, all those things, early season crops did fantastic in these jugs. And now's the time to start them. It doesn't matter if it's raining or snowing or freezing in your neck of the woods, it doesn't matter. Just get your jugs set and the seeds will start germinating when they're ready and it'll be months before you could do it outside in the cold soil. You find yourself just a regular old fashioned milk jug, okay? Uh, if you don't drink milk, you can go buy a coffee store and you can ask them for some of those and they'll give them to you for free, okay? It's free greenhouse. Before you cut it, drill some holes or pop some holes in the bottom. Then also pop some holes in the side. This is for drainage, okay? If these ones get plugged, these ones still work. Just drill a little hole here maybe and that'll help you cut around here and I did this with scissors probably the easiest way to go and you want to leave a little bit right there look at that it's got its own little handle carrying case waka 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 and then we'll get some seeds in here and we're going to tape this up and you can do this with your kids it's so easy this really is something that they do in grade school in fact teachers great thing to do with your students with it this is a white onion a storage onion and there's probably uh well there's two grams worth there's probably 100 150 seeds in here and we're actually going to put them all in here and when they sprout they'll start growing up out the top of the lid and then we'll transplant them into the garden they don't stay in here the whole time this is just your greenhouse the way to get started we use this earth grow you can find it at a big box store whatever you have close to you okay just good potting soil just rough them up a little bit make sure they have good contact and there you have it you just made your own greenhouse how easy is that so you're going to want to keep a little bit of moisture in here. Heft this. This is wet soil. So heft this and feel how heavy that is. If yours starts getting dry, just stick the hose in there and give it a little squirt and it'll be just fine. Tape it up nice and tight. And don't forget to mark it so you know what's in there because you'll hate it if you forget it. <laughs> One thing to keep in mind when you do your jugs, these seeds, they can withstand anything. You can put them out in December in Antarctica. It doesn't matter, okay? They're just going to sit there and they're going to wait until the circumstances are right where you live and then they will germinate and pop. So you don't need to do anything to them all winter, okay? However, when your seeds start germinating and you have leaf growth in here, if you're expecting a snow or a freeze, then you need to cover them. So I recommend putting them all together and then you can just put a blanket or an old sleeping bag or whatever over the top of them so they don't freeze to death but until they pop, you're golden. So it's really that easy. You just need to get out and get yourself a couple packs of seeds, a little bit of dirt, and a couple of milk cartons, and you can have your own little greenhouse right at home. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit the like and subscribe. We'd love to talk to you online as well. Hit us up with all your questions. I'll get back to you as often as we can, okay? Happy growing.